Welcome to Cannes, where the biggest names in movies come to frolic on the French Riviera, hyping their films and competing for the coveted Golden Palm Award, the most prestigious prize on the film festival circuit. What was your reaction to the script and to the visual nature of the film? Like, I was amazed with how the story was told and I, I was impressed with the fact that they didn't use the standard, uh, uh, well, just they didn't use any generic ways of telling a story. They were using the estuaries and the waterways of Sydney to, uh, to reflect the emotive basis of the characters and when there are changes in the film you can see that uh, through the cinematography and, um, and the reflection on, on the watermarks or etc. as goes the title. So. It was interesting. It's essentially about um, what happens to this uh, central character and an event happens and it's all about the things he can't say so he has to internalise um, an event and and so he can't he can't speak openly about this particular event that's occurred so so in a way you know we had to find a way of, of having a very visual language to back that up about this man's internal sort of dilemma. Everything from the first time the script was written, it wasn't written like a normal script, it was written as a series of images. Um, the actors, when they first saw the script, they went, oh my goodness, this is quite different because it was, this is the image, this is the dialogue where we have to have it, and this is the sounds that will go with it. And that's the way the script was presented. It wasn't presented as a script, it was presented as a, a visual piece. How comfortable were you with a film that relies so heavily on visuals? Um, it, can be, it, it can be challenging but also quite rewarding because you're using different parts of, of yourself and having to, um, well, your, your emotions are coming through, maybe not through the words you're saying, but through your physicality, yeah. So it's interesting work. From the Cannes Film Festival, I'm Andrew Warren for Showtime Movie News. I'll see you next time.